Good morning around the back. I put it up there, Mr. California. I put it down there. I had it down there, Mr. California. You know who's getting them down. You got a bill with the girl on the way. We just did it. Hey, it's Mobile. Let's Absolute vulgar display of RF power. Don't know the power of the dark side. Oh, DVI out here. Let me get out of here. A DVI out here started talking to you, you and I. He had to run his job. We only let you, you and I, 278. Yeah, 278. I didn't know DBI was out here. Holy shit, let me go out and turn my beam. I gotta point it out towards like Chicago, that direction. How about a DBI? You got a copy on BBI? Break, break. I'm not doing a DBI. BBI. DBI. 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 I'm saying, hey. You muddy mouth dyslexic mofos. Jesus. A huge difference between me and DBI, man. <laughs> God damn. I'm not doing a DBI. I see you, 278. Yeah, I heard Mr. California. I think he might have been uh, piggybacking on your station there a little bit ago. But that's the whole reason I fired down. I was like, oh, wow. 809 finally figured out how to turn his beam. I'll be son of a bitch. <laughs> Local talking, key and look, when you're driving down the road and you pull up underneath your buddy's antenna and key down and key on skip land, man, that's a mud duck move. You trying to tell me 809's out there ducking? No, not Mr. California. Not Mr. All Show, All Talk, got to negotiate, going to get out there and call the fight, talk to Schmack. No, he would never pull a mud duck maneuver like that. No, not 809. You mean he's the kind of mud duck that'll like slice your throat and then try to stab you in the back while in the in the phone booth trying to get your girlfriend to give him a hand job? Kind of low down, dirty, rotten, son bitch. Okay, I got it now. <laughs> Zero F's given, I understand. I understand. I understand. Well, good morning time wave to you. I just thought I'd come out here and band, uh, or bend a little bit of a Super Bowl band around a little bit on the finger and see what we got going on. Just have to sit back and wait, I guess, for 809 to see if he can figure out how to turn his house north. But then again, I don't know. Maybe the string's broken. I don't know. I hear you in the mobile when your neighbor lets you talk. I heard you in the mobile. Go ahead. Yeah, man. Come on.
the dirty mud duck. Well, good morning time to you, Dynamite. I say good morning time to you, Mr. Dynamite. Now, you, you're being a, a couple of mofo out there. I got to tell you, Dynamite, because 809, Mr. California, he's out there in a mobile and you're cutting him clean off the knees. I think that's why I probably gave up on having a mobile myself, because everybody and their brother trying to key on me coming out of the corner. Four Dan? <laughs> Oh, Mr. Two Dollar Bill, you know who said it? Your friend up here in the corner got down. I appreciate you putting a bum on me, my good friend. Been a long time no talk to you, Mr. Two Dollar Bill. Your friend sitting out here in the corner got down. Bye, 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 bye. You know how this goes, two dollar bill. Thou shalt talk to thy radio. Okay, that's, that's rule number one. Rule number two, no politicking on twenty seven dot oh two five. Thou shalt talk to thy radio. Brother, right here right now. Last two keys. You stood up all by yourself. Just thought you ought to know. Mr. Two Dollar Bill, your friend in the corner got down. I said, we'll see you, two dollar bill. I said, we'll see you, Mr. Two Dollar Bill. I heard some homeboy out there talking about how eight or nine got him ten eight. I believe that. Mr. California's got a little bit of radio knowledge going on between his two ear holes. So I have faith in that. I believe in that. I have knowledge that that could possibly happen. Mr. Two Dollar Bill, I appreciate you, brother. It's getting mighty, mighty, mighty in the background right behind you. They're starting to chase on your tail. But I heard you in there, and I just had to put the pump right back to you. Two dollar bill out of California, your friend in the corner got down. Two dollar bill is in the man cave in Los Angeles, and we go. Bye bye. Do you got your dead key all the way at like maximum or something? Because your audio is like super pinched up, brother. Well, you did just that, Dynamite. You put your foot on his neck, that's for sure. Here, 809 telling him to back it down a little bit, I think. I think that's what I heard. I'll have to go back and review the tape. Come back to that later. Dynamite roll right over the top. I'll put my foot on their necks. I'm going to cut them all clean off. That's what I heard, and that's what I'm rolling back. Mrs. Dynamite White, your friend in the corner, got down. Don't know the power of the dark side. You need a giant piece of steel transmitter. Rocking on. All right, then, uh, DBI. Let's well, 278, I don't know if he keyed or not. 
He told him to get on down with his bad self, Desert Arm Rolling Bag. Mr. 278 around California with Mr. 809 in a mobile hauling ass home to get into this mother nature. I just know it. 278, don't be getting into no traffic accidents. Don't be cutting off no little old ladies. Now, I don't know if they've turned to your state free yet, but man, take it easy getting home. It ain't worth it. Just a little bit of mother nature. 809, Mr. 278, Dynamite White, $2 bill, BBI in the corner, got down. <laughs> I said, we'll see you, 278. I got crazy, crazy out there jumping up and down, want me to say his name, too. So I'll put a bump out there to him also. Oh, Mr. Crazy, crazy. You know who said it. I can't forget you, 599. You're the only dead fucker out there talking. When I first fired down. Oh, 599. Write that down. 599. 99! Like Brooklyn 99. Oh, Mr. 599, jumping up and down. Quit jumping up and down, man. You're going to make a man booby shake. BBI, rocking on. Hey, BBI, right. Two out of B and down on, sir. And all around the corner, the northwest corner, Mr. BBI. Right down, two dollar bill, we go. You know your name's already on that Hall of Fame two dollar bill. You need to sit back, you need to relax, you need to put a big old smile up on your face, kick your feet up, grab a beer, and know that you made the Hall of Fame about fifteen keys ago when you held it down for four times all by yourself. Just a two dollar bill. Just reaffirming something I know you already know. BBI? Looking around to see what's going down next. Break Oh, Mr. Blue Star? I said, oh, Mr. Blue Star? In a long time, no talk to. My friend, Mr. Blue Star, what's going on with you today, man? Come on over here, let's talk about it. Let's have ourselves a little conversation on 27.025, right? I heard rice and bees down there around the donkey show, all the way deep, 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 deep south of California. He was super and hollering, and somebody said, man, I got my tower cranked all the way down, but I got you over 30 dBs in my radio, BBI, and then you never said your name. Man, give me a name to write in the book. Let me put your name on the Hall of Fame. Roll it back and let me know what your handle is. BBI reading a duck fucking mail. Yo devil, yo devil, yo devil, hey BBI, yo devil, yo devil. That's what I heard. So yo devil, you made the Hall of Fame for today, my friend. You'll be in a YouTube video here later on this afternoon. Yo devil, I still want to know who that monster station was. They said they were going to fire down just one old time to tell me hello. On their beam that's only 30 foot off the ground. BBI being nosy. Hey, we going to make it hard on you. There we go. That's what I've been expecting to hear out of your station. That's the signal I've been looking for, 278. Not this 9 and 15 dBS BS that you got going on. Man, you just put me almost 40 over in the corner. Mr. 278. You're going to make it hard on him. You definitely did that. <laughs> 
I knew you had a pump house switch that you could go to. 278, your friend in the corner. Rolling Mud Duck Watts got down. Yes, you're right. Yes, you're right. Okay, then. We're going to get on out of here. Hey, man, uh, we got a couple of things we got to do. God bless you and have a good day. Keep your mouth on your face. From the deep side. Big beat DBI. Two stuff, eight, two stuff. I said, we'll see you, 278. I said, we'll see you, 278. You go on, get 107. You said, you got things you got to go do. I don't know if they're honeydews or what you got going on. But we'll see you, Mr. 278. You know who said it? The big old Goliath Goliath in the northwest corner. <laughs> on the east side, in the bottom of the northwest, got down. Hey, baby, hi. Oh, you're rolling back because you're the only one out there. But you definitely made my needle move up off of zero. Oh, little devil. I'll put it at you one more time. Mr. Little Devil with all that echo going on. What's going on around your stack of bricks, break? Hey, what's up, I know he has a lot of nothing there, brother. I know he has a lot of nothing, brother. I'll make a right sure I write this down. There's a little devil. 701. <laughs> And then I had another duck pucker fire down and tell me a whole lot of nothing. He said he's got a whole lot of nothing going on. Of course, he didn't give me no handle, so I can't put it up on the Hall of Fame. You know how this goes, little red devil, or little, little devil. You ain't got a handle. You ain't making the bucket of fame today, break. Put your gun up in Idaho. Put your gun up in Idaho. Oh, I got it there, had it in the in Washington. Oh, DBI. Oh, BBI. Oh, BBI. I got this gun open watching on Idaho, man. Well, I get it that you got your gun pointed out here. I get it that you got your gun pointed out around the old tater patch country, Idaho. Because we hear you, man. A whole whopping 20 dBs over. So we got a little bit of a good copy going on. What about some California you sitting, amigo? We'll see you, little devil. Appreciate you, brother. You've been out there jumping up and down, hooping and hollering and making my name get up on your radio all morning long. Man. Sitting over here taking notes. I got the video game rolling today, guys. And I got the audio gig going on line level technology. I'm wondering who's next. I said, I'm wondering who's next. I said, I'm wondering who's next. This great big old giant piece of steel lurking around in the waters of Idaho got down. Man, oh man, Golden, you had Golden Rocket in there. <laughs> I think I heard Kingpin. I'm trying to remember the other handle that just popped off on my radio. I ain't heard him in a month of years. Man, let's see who rolls back up around on this next key. Maybe we can catch him again. Oh, Kingpin, good afternoon. Your friend in the corner got down. Oh, grass shack. The black judge in Southern California is reading the mail. Shaking shore. Flip 50 from our station.
Station down south. Right there, back 522. No pain, no strain. Cat Biggie, you up in my radio. Mr. 522, the Black Judge in Pasadena, California, is reading the mail. I heard old 650 way down south. I said I heard old 650. He put me at about 10, 15 dBs way down south. But the bike judge rolled up in here at 20 dBs all by himself. And I'm just wondering if I can bend his receiver. Oh, black judge. This little mud duck sitting up here in the corner got down. L-O-T-B-B-I. Hey, don't attempt to adjust that down, Captain Bigger. Hey, B-B-I, ain't nobody but 63 crews in these almighty bones getting down. Homie the clown, homie the clown, homie the clown got down. I said, homie the clown, homie the clown, homie the clown got down. I ain't touching nothing, duck bucker. Where you been? Got 809 rolling around out there in a the mobile making easy prey of himself. I said, where the hell you been, homie? Break. Searching for these mud ducks. Hey, baby, I'm down on my way. Good morning, man. Good morning, man. Good morning, man. Good morning, 10-4. Oh, rice and beans all rolled it out. This is like this. Oh, homie, the clown fired down. He got about two syllables out. Oh, my God. A long-ass day already. He got two syllables out. And our good friend over there, down in my white world up, and he started yelling at me. And the next thing I know, I got the crazy guy down there around the border named Rice and Beans telling me to tell him that it's a friendly five. A63, Mr. Homie the Clown, Rice and Beans is rolling it back to you. He says, friendly five, and he's saying hello. Landlord in this corner got down. And oh my God, the nature's sitting in the right place. So let me get out of here, O3-O-O squad. Where are you off again, DVI? Man, you just fired down and took them all out, 3 double O. God damn it. And if I'm not mistaken, I heard your partner in crime, CC, out there a couple keys back. Hello, Mr. 3 double My friend, what's going on around the Yola stack of bricks? Not much. I heard you out. I've turned everything on so I can say hello to you, my friend. I don't usually turn it on, but I'm supposed to be in the south. The south mine is other room over there. I gotta roll it out just like this. Hey, three double O. You fired down some men, you gotta turn you turn all this stuff on just so you can say hello to me. And then I hear Hey BBI, tell him to turn more on. <laughs> hey BBI, tell him to turn more on. Rice and beans got down. That's what I heard, so that's what I'm rolling back. A three double O. You gonna make a move? Or is somebody gonna get hurt? Let's see, BBI, read the mail. And I don't know what happened. God, Mother Nature is moving so fast. Jeez, almighty. Three double O. Only heard him there at the tail end of things. Never heard rice and beans again. Oh my God. Look at it move. And it hopped right on over. And it hopped right on over. Look at that. I'll be damn shame. Fell all the way down, all the way down, all the way down. About three dBs, you guys. He went from 25 to 30 dBs all the way down to three. Shame on the mess. Shame on the mess. Dynamite White, you come right over the top. Oh, Mr. Dynamite White, I'm going to roll it back because you're the one to come in my radio. You know who said it, and I'm reading the mail. A man's got to do what a man's got to do. That's right. Mr. Dynamite White, a man's got to do what a man's got to do. Good job, but I think what happened is Mother Nature flip-flopped. I said, I think Mother Nature flip-flopped hard. 
And now it's sitting right over the top of your front porch. Don't know what your friend got down. Hey, 717, man, you got some audio, good, clean audio. Hey, 717, you got good, clean audio, 2020, let you know. Real big here. My head real big. I got real big here. You don't have to spoil my head, Doug. Hey, bye, Doug. You don't have to spoil my Doug's bigger head, man. I got a real big head. Oh, bye, Doug. Oh, go a little rocket down here. Look it up. I'll see you. Bye. Go easy, you catch you later, I'm gone. Well, I'll stand for a while, I'll see you. Hey, Green, I told you you seen them yesterday. Five twenty-two. Get out here. Who knows? I missed it. I got some of the recordings the guys put up, but I missed it. Oh, wow. So, if I'm to understand you right, 3-double-O, to get the same job done with less power is better hobbying. But what if I like doing the same job with more horsepower? Is that bad hobbying? Or is that just aggressive hobbying? Well, you know, the variation is what you need. 3-double-O, 3-double-O, you need to be able to transition from high to low if you need to. When you need to use high and low, like, a, for example, right now, I'm just down low, swinging up high. I have the capability of... He needs to go borrow. He needs to go borrow some more BBI. Rice and bean is gone. <laughs> <laughs> That's your little, I got to tell you, man. Rice and bean is fired up right at the very end. You, you're talking about the ability to vary from one extreme to the next, so... Hello, audio. Hello, audio. <laughs> There's a lot of string. Hello, audio. Going for it, way for it. Ew. No reason to key 20, swing for it almost to 40. Hey, uh, <laughs> 3 double O, I gotta tell you, you're sitting there telling us that, you know, you gotta be able to have the ability to run low and then go high if you want. And right about then, the rice and beans fired down and said, tell them to go borrow more. Hey, BBI, tell them to go borrow more. Rice and beans gone. Bye. Click. <laughs> Well, he fired down. He said that you're supposed to go check your SWR. I got to roll that along because that was what was in my radio. <laughs> he says, man, tell him he needs to go check his SWR. I'm sitting over here thinking, man, I don't know if I'd tell a NASA deep space communications engineer that he needs to go check his SWR, but I'll roll the five because that's what happened. And then he rolled out and you'd come back like along and he said for me to tell him he should consider himself lucky to be able to get in there and get that one in on you. So I rolled it back just the way I heard it. Mr. 3 double your friend in the corner got down. Yeah, okay. You know me, I'm going to give him... Hey, hey, BBI, I'm going to give him props for what he do, because outside, when he says he keyed on 3 double that's going to be something that he can bring it up. I'm going to give him a on me, and everybody look at me like, yeah. But I will tell them that he did it, Defo Tent. Well, that's going to be out there on Public Review Street for everybody on the YouTube channel here this evening. But no, that's what I like about you, man. You're a straight shooter. Ain't no BS to you, man. He was trying that whole key. He was trying and trying and trying, but you stand strong, man. He walked you down to where I couldn't understand a little bit of what you said. 
but it wasn't him over the top. Yeah, you got to give credit where credit's due. If somebody hits you, man, you're going to get, we're all going to get hit. It doesn't matter how big you are. You're going to get hit. If you're not reading your radio right, or you're not doing something right, or hell, man, even if you're slow rolling it, low keying it, you might get hit. And that's just the name of the game. And if you get hit, it's a good job. And that's what you said you were going to do when he goes out there and he goes and he brags about it. Because we know he's going to do it. You're going to say, well, I'm damn straight, key dummy. He got the key down. That's all there is to it. Give him something to brag about. 3-0-0. Nothing but admiration and admiring in the way you're conducting yourself. Your friend in the corner with my Doug Watts got down. And BBI, see, the reason why I'm like that is because I really do want to be a big boy by the time I get up where I need to be. You know, I don't think I'm a big boy yet, but I think I'm a big boy in making. You know, I think I'm a real big boy in making. I think if you look at the band and look at what guys are doing and look at the guys you consider big boys, I do think I can fit up there it's somewhere around, you know, the top 50 or whatever. And I'm proud of that. Hey, BBI, I'm proud of that. Because I know I'm doing what I can with what I got. And Rice and Bean should be proud and happy to do what he's doing because I know he's standing up real strong right now, probably knocking me down and, and try, probably slapping me around. And that's all good because Mother Nature sometimes give it away. But I bet you my day is more so often than his. No, homie. You stood all by yourself from the beginning of the key all the way to the very end. Crystal clear, loud and proud audio. I don't think anybody was keying with you, to be honest with you. But I don't think it would have mattered. Now that you're pushing that needle all the way over there at 50. I've seen you go from 10 to 50, down to 0, back up to 25, then back up to 50. Nah. Even the big boys get hit from time to time. I wouldn't know what that's all about. I'm not a big boy. I'm just a little mud dug. Never even tried to try to be a big boy. Not even all that ain't even concerned with it. Just run what you brung, spring with what you spring, and do what you're going to do. I'm going to get keyed on. That's the bottom line. I'm sure right now, as I sit here and I talk to you, there's somebody planning, plotting, and trying to figure out some way they're going to be able to get around me. It's going to happen, and you just got to give credit. But when it does happen, meh, build bigger. That's always been my philosophy. And not just the box, we're talking the antenna, because there's easier gains made at the antenna than there is at the box. But 3 double you you're doing the best of what you got. You're standing tall and you're putting the wood down in my radio, there ain't no doubt about that. Nine times out of ten, you're going to roll over the top, and that's just the way it is. 3 double O, your friend in the corner, rolling it right back. And I appreciate you, bro. I appreciate you that thing. It is so much fun. So you take care, man. I'm going to get on out of here. Tell Rice and Bees, I say, great job, man, dog on it. I, I, hats off to him. And I'm going to get on back to my work. Hey, BBI, you 3 double O, the most interesting man on the bottom side of the Cali. When I'm playing around, I call myself the head honcho. But I'm your friend down on the bottom end of Cali. Oh, 3 double I see you, 3 double O. And, brother, you are one of the BBI nation, so it is what it is. Now, I'm not politicking, I'm not game playing, but I had to sit here and wait. I just sit here and wait because uh, 3 double held my radio. But i got to be honest, I heard somebody squeak up in there. They didn't take you so out, that's why I didn't run to them. And I sat here and I listened to you, my friend. But old homie the clown says he wants to see if he can make his homeboy talk even more. And he's trying, he's pushing on the front door. But he did not take sole control, so that's the reason I stuck and I stayed. A 3 double your friend in the corner, rolling it right back to you. Friend of mine. But BBI, I don't need to say more, do I, there, buddy? 
I don't think either one of you gentlemen need to say another thing. Since the first half of the conversation was 3 double telling me that he's a good friend of yours. And the last half of the conversation was you saying you don't need to say another thing because he's a good friend of yours, 63. Man, you guys need a group hug. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, shame on the mess. All right, I'm going to hit the off switch. i got to get out of here. i got errands. i got to go run. Tell everybody behind me in the corner the green light's on. Tell them to play and have fun. I'll be back here in about an hour or so. 3 double O. And hold me the clown, because homie don't play that. I'll be back, gentlemen. I'll see you guys. Click, click, click. Don't know the power of the dark side. I'll see you. Bye. I have to tell him no, 300. 82780 says he can hear you. And 300 says he got down, got down, got down. All right, I ain't going to key again. The video gate don't lie, the audio gate don't lie, and I'll put it all together sometime tonight or it'll be up on YouTube. I'll see you, gentlemen. This great big old Goliath in the corner. Just sitting out here playing, having fun. No harm intended. With a giant piece of steel. And a great big old giant aluminum antenna got down. I'll see you, boys. Bye, bye, bye. They all my friends, but I'm going to sign off for all of them. They all my friends, hey, BBI, but I'm going to sign off for all of them on the video game. Hey, hell, what to see? I heard you, but BBI got that mall down. The clown and the killer field on these double boats. Check that.